how y'all feeling out there? Let's light them up a little bit. Let's look at all the smiling faces we got going on. Good to see everybody. <laughs> All right, so listen, we've been together a long time. And when you're together for a long time, you share the same brain sometimes, and sometimes one person does one thing and it's almost like as if you did it. Well, basically, what I was going to say right now, Patricia already told you. Because she stole my lines. She did. She totally stole my lines. But I'm going to throw it at you one more time anyway, so pay attention here. It's very simple. It goes like this. We are celebrating our 35th year anniversary, as you can see back there. And how that began, it began in the month of May of 1979 in New York City. We were introduced to one another, and we got along pretty well. We got along pretty good. We got along pretty good. So the same way I know it is, we got along pretty well. Okay. She had an idea and I had a plan, so we got on an airplane. We left New York for Los Angeles, California. 28 days later, we had a record complete call, In the Heat of the Night. <laughs> After we finished that record, we went back to New York City. And then we went through the Midwest, then we went to the West Coast, and up the West Coast into Canada, through Canada, out of Canada, into Europe, into France, Germany, Switzerland, Italy, everywhere. We came back to America. We told our managers, wow, it's going to be nice to have a couple days off. They said, no, it's not. We're going to go in the studio. So we did another record called Crimes of Passion. Oh, yeah. Now that leads us to the present day, 1979, 2014, 35 years. God bless you all. Thank you for coming. And if you still like us by the time you're done, we're done. Come and visit for the next 35 years again, all right? All right, have a good time. Doing heartbreaker with a walker. <laughs> Alright, this next song I'm gonna do, you love this next song. I love this next song. I can pretty much guarantee that you have sung this song at karaoke. At least once. Definitely the hairbrush in the mirror. <laughs>